On this episode of African Barbecue Hunter, we visit Namibia in Southern Africa. We visit Wilson Fontaine Outfitters in the rugged, most beautiful mountainous area. From the capital of Namibia, Vintuk, we travel about 70 kilometers northwest towards the small town of Okahanya. Okahanya lies in the central region of Namibia, and from here, another 110 kilometers south to a small town, Karabib. An 80 kilometer gravel road through the mountains for another hour until we reach the entrance gate of Wilsonfontein, one of the most scenic farms in Namibia. 28,000 hectares of majestic mountains, grassy plains. First on the Barbecue Hunter's agenda is to hunt a springbok in the wide open plains of the spectacular region of Namibia. person that knows this farm like the palm of his hand, Simeon, was put in charge to offer the barbecue hunter a great hunt. And it's not easy. It's a long walk up and down the ridges and taking enough water along on a hunt is a must. Rocky areas provide excellent elevation to be able to spot the game from above without being noticed. A big herd of springbok in the plain, but no cover making a stalk almost impossible. A different herd this time, but once again not even a shady spot to hide from the sharp eyes one of Africa's most favorite animals. To be successful with a hunt in these areas, you might have to go down on all fours, and that is what makes hunting at Wilson Fontaine an unbelievable experience. It's hard work, but the reward awaits those who persist. Success at last, the African barbecue hunter with his first Namibian springbok.
Thank you. You're welcome. And it cheers. And I like I told you, left hand, huh? Always, because I'm a hunter. Cheers, sir. <laughs> exactly. The great huh? hunt at Wilson Fort Wayne, um, thanks. in Namibia. One and of the best places, the most scenic beauty you will ever find in your life. A great and experience. We had uh, two days of hunting here, good stalking. My knees are still sore. <laughs> you know the story about the knees. I eh? know the story of the knees. Okay. <laughs> and uh, now we, have, we will have a good meal. Huh? Fantastic. Okay. Thank Cheers. Huh? Cheers. Cheers. Meat is, as expected, one of the staple dyes of hunters and the traditional skotel is to be found in every laupa or barbecue area. The fillets and backstrap of the springbok had no time to mature and straight from the butcher's block to the barbecue. Once grilled medium to rare, it is wrapped in tin foil and left to rest for a few minutes, while the lamb chops and the traditional bourrevors or sausage is cooked to perfection. to dig in. Now we're in for a feast. Smoked fillet. It's going to be absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. Cheers. Cheers. To the man himself. The feast of the barbecue hunter. Off we go. African Barbecue Hunters proudly brought to you by RadressMedia.com, turning your hunt into a motion picture. Minox Optics, visible innovation. Musgrave Rifles, the legend is back. Next Wheel Gear and Reach Line of New Zealand by Wolverine, relentless by nature, and by Ocherusa Safaris, experience true Namibian beauty.